Mario. Hokey dokey, here we go! That hurts my throat, by the way, so I hope somebody out there appreciated it. Anyway, Super Mario is one of the most recognized video game characters in all gaming, one of the most recognized video game franchises ever. Is, as a character is more recognized than Mickey Mouse himself, which you should already know Mickey Mouse is a pretty fucking popular character. But Mario, yeah, he's up there. And the thing is, Mario has changed so much throughout the years, from the 8-bit little Super Mario running around, all the way up to Super Mario Galaxy 2. And this doesn't include all the little offshoot titles like, you know, Mario Golf and Mario Kart and Mario Tennis and things like that, but just like the main series, uh, the platforming series. Well, here's my question. What is your favorite power-up? Now, I know that that's a broad question because Mario has a ton of them. And when I was thinking about the topic of this video, I started thinking about all the different power-ups that Mario has acquired throughout the years. Now, take into account, yes, there is the mushroom. The mushroom makes him bigger. There is the uh, one mushroom that makes him as big as the screen, and he just runs through everything. Then there's some of the hats that he gets. He could put on and become Metal Mario, which has that bitchin' fucking music I love to death. Or... There's one that makes him fly everywhere. Super Mario World, he could put on a cape. He can fly all over the place. Some could even consider Yoshi to be a power-up, because he he's, he kind of is. I mean, it's his little pal. It's kind of like, I don't know, Voltron. They combine together, it's like... Rah, 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 rah. And then they go around just eating everything, because that's what they do. And then take into account, like, Super Mario Galaxy 2 involves some new ones. You know, what about the B-Suit Mario? That one was kind of cool, the spring. And I, then I think about Super Mario 3, which is one that has some of the more classic power-ups, I thought, like the frog suit, the Tanuki suit, where you got the tail, you can fly and everything, but you can also turn to a statue, and an enemy will just right past you, because they apparently didn't see you turn into that statue, and everybody that is employed by Bowser is fucking retarded, and or blind. I don't know what the case may be. It's one of those two, though. Because they're just like, there's Mario! <laughs> He's here just a second ago. I swear he was. Where the fuck did he go? There's a statue here, but... And it's right where he was at, but... Fuck this. I'm gonna go get a beer, because I need one now. You know, that's... that That's kind of like... Just weird that they never know us. But anyway, you know, he's got all those power-ups. Then, you know, there's one of his most legendary, the star. Oh my gosh, the star. The star which allows Mario to basically destroy anything that runs in his way. It's, I'm gonna get you, Mario! No, I'm not! Bye! And then they disappear, just fall right off the stage. And, oh, there's also the water pack from Super Mario Sunshine. Which, that one, I think it's not exactly one of my personal favorites, but yeah. All those, and there's so many more. I know that I'm, I'm leaving out a ton, um, mostly because it would take forever to go over them. But um, I, I will name off my own personal favorite, and that's the Hammer Brothers suit. I love the Hammer Brothers suit. It's from Super Mario Brothers 3, if anybody's wondering. Hammer Brothers suit. Um, one, It's one of the hardest ones to acquire. It really is. But when you get it, you feel so fucking awesome. Like, you get a little Hammer Brothers outfit, like the Hammer Brothers have. So you got the hat, and you got the little... Uh, back protector thing. I don't know, it's like a turtle shell, but made of steel. <laughs> Bowls of steel. Yep, a Duke Nukem reference in a Super Mario video. <laughs> Hooray! Anyway, um, but it's kind of cool because you can just chuck hammers everywhere. It's just like, and he pulls them out of thin air. Mario just doesn't give a fuck. He's got like pockets that have, that rip a hole in like space and time and he just reaches in them and he's just like, and all the enemies that even are stupid enough to get away, they're just like, <laughs> fuck! <laughs> Absolutely owned and destroyed. Um, oh, and when you duck down, if any kind of like fire or projectile goes to hit you, it just <laughs> fizzles out of existence and it doesn't matter. Why? Because Hammer Brothers suit's so awesome. It's just that when you lose it, Mario gets hit and you lose it, it's like, it's the worst feeling. I shit you not. The first time I ever lost a Hammer Brothers suit, I lost it within, like, under a minute of going out of my way to acquire it. I chucked a controller so fast, I was like, FUCK! Ah! Ah! <laughs> Little kid rage. Yeah. It, it had it coming. But anyway, 
that's my personal favorite out of like all of them. I really do like the Metal Mario. I'll have to say that one's probably my second favorite. I just thought it was cool, like how he looked like whenever he put it on was just so neat. Then again, I like the music a lot. But Metal Mario? Metal Mario! Yeah! Q heavy metal, death metal, uh Super Mario Brothers theme. Um but I'm just wondering, what are some of your favorites? What's your all-time favorite? You know, if you can actually pick one. I want you guys to comment down below about it. Because there's so many, so, so many of his power-ups to think about. So yeah, choose wisely. And if you so desire to really get into it, make a video response about it. Why? Because it would be amusing. But that's what I'm doing right now. Obviously, it is amusing. I'm entertained right now. <laughs> entertained. Anyway, so I want you guys to go talk about whatever the fuck you want to talk about when it comes to Super Mario Brothers power-ups and stuff. So comment, video response, whatever the case may be. Do it. Why? Because, well, you're nerds. Like me. And that's what we do. So anyways, this is Alpha Omega Sin saying, nerds, nerdettes, game the fuck on.